and I, how are y'all doing? It's January the 31st, 2023. Almost said 22. So it's a blue sky here with clouds today. It was supposed to be cloud covered and snow, but we didn't get no snow. And we got blue sky with all the bunch of the clouds going through. So, hmm, I wonder what's up with that. All right. So I was, I was reading an article this morning, a video actually, with an article attached to it. And it was from a, a news, I follow, a new, an independent news source I follow, or subscribe to, I should say, right? And um, they found a reporter was flying a drone around the mountains in Nepal. He was a Nepal, Nepalese, Nepal, I don't know how to say that reporter he was from the country right and um, he seen a giant head face coming out of the side of the mountain and it was either a petrified giant or a statue a carving but it was uncovered after a mountain slide some of the mountain let go and what was revealed was this giant head, this giant face, I should say, right? A man with, was a male with a long mustache. It looked very real. The eyes were perfect. Everything was perfect about it. To me, it looked like a petrified giant, right? Because when things petrify, they turn to stone. So, hmm, curious. I wonder if they'll release it to the public or if they'll, if they'll hide the video. Because they scrub so much from the internet. If you use Google, don't. It's censored big time. Right? Find a different search engine. DuckDuckGo is better than Google any day. Even my one of my sons said it. My second son. He's like, Mom, what search engine do you use? And I said, DuckDuckGo. He goes, perfect. He says, see, I've taught you something. I said, because Google's um, censored. He says, yep. He says, it has been for a long time. It's gotten worse. He says, I'm glad you know. You know. So, and they were raised with computers, right? He's like, what, 37, 38 years old now? So I'm like, I think he'll be 38 this year. Or maybe he is 38 on his birthday. So, yeah, right? So I found that was interesting. I hope they bring out this video so y'all can see it. It is phenomenal, this face on the side of a mountain in Nepal. It's not around a city or a village or anything, right? They have a, a large mountainscape, just like here in Canada, right? You know, you couldn't see them all unless you were flying because it's just so vast. Mountains are ma it's mountain ranges, right? So, yeah, I thought that was really interesting. I did. With all the weird stuff that's going on in the realm, you know? With all the, the airships and... The sky or sky phenomenon, they call it phenomenon, right? Because we don't know what it is. Well, it's not, uh, yeah, I don't know phenomenon, what it really means. You're going to have to look up that word. So, yeah, stuff's been going on with the suns, with the moon. I've seen many ships myself just in the last year, last two years. It's been just, yeah, more than I've seen previous to all this crap in 2020, 2019. Right? I think the first time I seen one that I can remember. I seen a falling star when I was a little girl at the drive-in with my mom. And she said it was a falling star. Now I'm thinking it was probably a, a skyship, airship, right? And then after that, the first one that I can truly remember is 2001. I was in a, on a flight coming back from Vancouver to go to Bracebridge. I had to go to a murder trial in Barrie. Well, I wasn't going to Bracebridge. I was going to Barrie. I had to go to a murder trial. And they flew me back too, right? The RCMP made me go. They paid for my flight. I got paid for attending. And all I said when I was there is, I can't remember. It's been a couple of years since that's happened. I have a lot going on in my life. I have six children. I can't remember, right? I'm not doing their job for them. They had enough proof. They didn't need me anyway. It was just, yeah, way to spend money. I don't know, right? So, yeah, it's interesting. Um, I wonder what's going to happen next. What do you think's going to happen next? It's going too slow for me. Way too slow. I was just wish a solar flare would come and, you know, snap us all back into what we're supposed to be doing. You know? 
I do. So that's enough of that today. I just wanted to get on here, make a short video. Okay, I've been getting really sharp pains in my skull today. Like really, really strong, sharp. They don't last for long, but boy, they're sharp, let me tell you. I wonder how y'all feeling today. So symptoms getting to you too. S ascension symptoms, some say they are, right? We really don't know, do we? But yeah, it's not killing me, so it's whatever it is, it is what it is. I can't do nothing about it. Except for stay hydrated, drink lots, try to eat healthy. Don't try to eat healthy, eat healthy. Why I say try is because most of the food in the grocery stores is poisoned with harmful chemicals, okay? Processed stuff. It's just horrible. Half the stuff that we were told to eat, you're, well, you know, like the food guide is right, it's not right, you know? It's not right at all. It's all, everything's been a lie. Everything's been turned upside down and just ass backwards. So, yeah, I figure just try for the less of the poison. You know what I mean? Go for the least of the poison. So, no processed foods. So, yeah. All right. I love you all's consciousness. Enjoy the rest of this night or day. Bye.